Okay, Cupid, hold your freaking Yule log. I'll get back around to you if I can. Jesus Christ, what a prima donna. Prancer, hey. Yeah, well, I'm sure you know by now, but Cupid needs to have everything his way all the time. I'm just checking my list here. It looks like flight training has been rough on you. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna just gonna give you a quick checkup. We're gonna need to do a lot of brushing. It looks like you got a lot of particulate from your flights. Um, how has it been? Have you liked it? Yeah, yeah, it's grueling, especially because we brought you in like two weeks before Christmas. So let me just uh, do a quick check. Did you get? Um, it looks like you went to see Dr. Twinkle um, for your antlers. Did they give you any medicine for your ears? I wrote them a note. Okay, well, we'll take care of that really quickly. Let me take a look. Okay, hon. Let's see. Oh, yeah. So, your case of paper snowflake, again, not horrific, but I will write Dr. Twinkle again to get you a prescription, and I'll take care of it right now. You just gotta make sure you... Here's Santa in a couple hours when you guys are up there, right? How are you feeling? Are you excited? Nervous? Yeah. Well, that's a pretty huge deal for our billions of people. So, <laughs> not that I want to put pressure on you. I'm sorry we really haven't gotten to hang out this season at all. Let me just take a look. I'm gonna get those snowflakes out of there, okay? Yeah, well, once Christmas is over, you're going to have some really nice downtime. You can, um, get to know the other reindeer a little better. Uh, avoid Cupid. Fucking put it on. Uh, no, I mean, I've had some great times with Cupid, but they just want everything just so, and they think that they are the most special reindeer, and they're always pissed off every year when Santa keeps them in number four. <laughs> Cupid's never gotten the lead. Not this version of Cupid, anyway. Cupid 5 was the lead for a while. Sometimes Santa changes it up, but he's very specific about what he wants every year. So. Yeah, Prancer was lead once or twice. But, um, you know. Santa's so always had kind of a thing. Like, he loves Prancer a lot. Uh, oh, I think I got it. These are cute. Your ears make cute snowflakes. There's another one in there though. I gotta get it. Um, yeah. Well, like I said, he doesn't... He doesn't know that we changed the reindeer. So he thinks every pitch is the same. And, you know, once or twice, he's kind of like, hey, is um, friends are sick. He's been acting weird lately because we had just switched him. Then I give coaching lessons to the next Prancer. Prancer's a sweetheart. Prancer's always been a sweetheart. And, uh... One more in there, bud. Sorry, yeah. Um, I'm a big fan of Dasher, too. Cupid. Somehow we always manage to hire on a Cupid that's a prima donna, so. Yeah. Oh, gosh. I know. I bet it's been tiring. They gave you a full rest last night, though, right? Do your uh, do your shoes for you. Oh, I can see them. Yeah, good. Oh man, I 
of it. We'll go get, we'll go get an eggnog tomorrow. And uh, you can tell me all about it. Mind if, um, do you mind if Dasher comes? Cool. No, you're gonna love Dasher. He's a really cool guy. Right here. an ointment for that and it'll be cleared up and we don't have to do that anymore um okay according to my checklist you need a severe brushing uh there is particulate all over you the sky is dirtier than you think it's gonna be right yeah Well, this kind of brushes all your fairy dust off, like whatever residue that you still had. So I'm going to need to do another application for you. And I got a fresh batch from the Pixies this morning. They were working overtime. So he's a newer reindeer. Um, I'm up doing him next. He's my last one. I'm exhausted. <laughs> yeah, Comet has only been around for a year or two. Uh, two years, yeah. He's been done two Christmases so far. Um, and his flying style is messed up, I've heard from the other reindeer. Yeah, he's all over the place. <laughs> you gotta watch out for him. Oh yeah, it's dusty as heck, right? <laughs> don't don't breathe in too much. Pixie dust isn't great for your lungs. Yeah. Oh, your shoes look great, bud. Belle did a good job on that. Oh yeah, she's been with us for a long while. She's fabulous. A great blacksmith. Great farrier. Oh yeah, she's one of my only elf friends, really. She's kind of a weird, nerdy introvert too, obsessed with her, with her fairy ring. And she's the only one that works as closely as with the reindeer as I do. Well, aside from Twinkle, but Twinkle's kind of a, well, you know, surgeons. <laughs> designing the, um, the reins and, um, the decorations this year. So Santa likes to really pretty up the reindeer for the flight because, you know, in case a child catches a glance, you want it to look really magical, right? So I do all the designs for, for what the reindeer are going to wear. Yeah, we're going to have to do that as well. Um, and I design new reins for this year and uh, new antler ornaments. Okay. I think you are fully brushed now, my friend. How are you feeling? Good. Um, next, we got to reapply the moisture. Uh, let me grab a towel again so that I can, yeah, one second. I've got a very special ointment today for your antlers. This is going to go on before the moisturizer. It's kind of a primer. Um, well, because you just got a bunch of it sawed off, uh, it's kind of a, a healing thing. Um, how has that been feeling, by the way?
Oh, yeah, it's a little sore. I lied to you a little bit when I said it wasn't going to hurt at all. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. I didn't want to scare you. It's, I mean, antlers have nerves in them. It's a little uncomfortable, but, but this is going to help. Um, we don't want the lotion to gum up the wound, so this is a protectant as much as it is um, a medicine. Your, your antlers, buddy. There you go. Okay, now the lotion. Oh, this stuff is gross and sticky. Yeah, I'm just gonna get your antler lotion going. I'm a little for the them nice and healthy. Gonna decorate them up too, so. Did you get taller? This is harder than it was. Or am I just exhausted? Probably. Gotta love Boxing Day. Everything just calms down for a long while. I mean, we start Christmas prep again in March, but we get off like two months and it's amazing. Need more. Sorry about that. Okay. All right, all moisturized. Yeah, it feels kind of gross, right? Okay, let me do a quick check, make sure everything's in order. Your shoes look great, actually. I don't think I'm gonna need to polish them at all. And we will get that fairy dust on you all around it. Fresh pixie dust. Makes me wish I was a reindeer. Okay. Starting with your antlers as per usual. from some of the other reindeer about that. Um, it just takes some time and some skill. You're probably going to get a retraining session this summer. Honestly, we've been thinking about starting a quarterly retraining schedule for the, for the new recruits and the lazier reindeer. Frickin' Cupid. Well, you seem really friendly. I bet you could befriend Cupid, honestly. I'm sure there's a nice reindeer under there, but... You are shimmering. Like a freshly wrapped Christmas present with too much glitter on it. Okay. Alright, let me check my checklist. Exhausted, gotta. Uh, still got one more, too. Yeah. Okay. Antlers. Oh, your face. Sorry, I missed that. Let me grab the other lotion. Yeah, 
gotta get your nose. You don't want that drying up out there. Whoa. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> that smells really good. Put it on my nose. decoration let me get your reins in okay um yeah they're a little uncomfortable the bit is not everyone's favorite but it is flavored like a candy cane i did that that was my idea <laughs> Okay, how's that feel? Okay, great. Next, so we have a theme. We go with a theme every year. And this year's theme is silver and gold. So we're gonna be putting some pretty glittery ornaments in your antlers and some ribbon. And then you are gonna be ready to go. I gotta get to Comet. Yeah, um, I am attaching these with glue. They're pretty easy to pull off. Antlers this time of year are, um, not really sticky, so it shouldn't be too bad, I hope. <laughs> I'll help you with it, I promise, uh, tomorrow morning. You will be working all night long to the break of dawn, just so you know. It will be probably the most tiring night of your life. I don't want to, I don't want to lie to you. I, uh, yeah. yeah. I'm sticking this one with a little bit of glue. Yeah, I designed the whole thing. And then I have to do the exact same thing on every reindeer. Santa is very... So we, pretty much, pretty much Santa can only see the top of your guys' head. The sleigh is kind of high, right? So I can only see your antlers. And he has a little bit of a thing about uniformity. Yeah, when I first started working here, I got in a lot of trouble for trying to do different things for the antlers. Santa is cool with me now. Mostly. I don't talk to him a lot. You know, I kind of just prep the reindeer for him and then get the sleigh ready and sometimes he'll leave me a present if I've been good. Which, hey, to be fair, most years I have been. Okay. Got those in place. Now, we're doing bows and I know that's a little childish. So I know this is uh, what you might have seen me in last time you saw me, but that day, seriously, after you and I had uh, done our thing, I was walking around and Santa came by and he saw it on my neck and he's like, that's beautiful. I want that on the reindeer. And I was like, you got it. So that's why I went with the silver and gold thing. So we're just going to kind of wrap it around like a candy cane, just on the lower part of the antlers. That's what we're doing. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I'm using tape again to get it to stay. <laughs> tape and glue are amazing. Yeah, well, I like, like I told you last time, I like to get this all done kind of early before Mrs. Santa Claus wakes up. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think we were doing a bow. Yeah, I did a bow. So I wrap 
prep and then I do a bow with the base here. Yeah, it looks really cutesy. It's a little, it's a little childish. It's one of my less adult looking designs. But, you know, perfect. Okay. Other side. Mrs. Claus. Comet's never gonna let me let this down. Good luck on your flight. 